to my channel my name is Michelle and if you are new welcome thank you for stopping by today and thank you to all my current subscribers I appreciate you more than you even know so today I have for you yet another Dollar Tree haul we had to do a few errands today so of course I had to stop by the Dollar Tree and I am so glad that I did because they had out some things that I never see in my store. So, we'll start with that first. We will go into seasonal. And, and this is a little bit of a different setup. I just came in and set everything kind of on my table. And I pushed my chair over and thought I'd like, this is what we have still. We still have a little bit of snow on the ground. It is melting out there. So, yes. All right, let's start with the seasonal. And y'all... I found the rugs, the seasonal rugs that Dollar Tree carries. So, this was the first one. They had four different patterns. So, if you have picked up or seen another pattern in your store, please let me know in the comment section below. But this is the first pattern that I seen, and it said, Hoppy Easter. Yes. Guys, these are really good to layer. I mean, yes, look how thin that they are. They are very thin. They do have a little bit of like a grip in the on the bottom, which would probably be okay like on my tile in like my um, kitchen or like at my garage door. But outside, I wouldn't put these just by themselves. Um, I'll insert a picture of how I normally use rugs like this on the outside. Um, like I said, you can you you can layer them with a fabric rug. I use mine uh, with a fabric rug before, and then I have a regular like outdoor rug that I just set mine on top. Okay, next one was the Happy Easter one, and it is just in this pretty green. Very simple, very simple, and even if I don't use. All four of these this year it is great to put these up because I very I've never seen them in my store um, Easter time last year summertime last year Christmas time the Halloween rugs I was really looking forward to getting the Halloween rugs and never could find them so I'm excited to be able to have found these this is the one I'm gonna set outside and I think this one just says Easter wishes and this one is the one that I'm going to set inside, and it says Easter Egg Hunt Country Rabbit Candy Company, established 1880. Let me turn this around so that you can kind of see, because maybe the light behind, you can't really see the detail, but it has like that wood grain uh, look to it, so... Yes, I'm excited to have found those. Yes, Dollar Tree. Okay, moving along to some other decor. I picked up, and this you've probably seen hauled, but the reasoning behind this is what I have found, and I'll show you in just a minute, but it's just this little round um, vase decor. Um, I have some floral greenery that I'm just going to kind of stick a couple in there for that. And I got the pink and blue one. And this is the reason why, guys. And you do not have to look. Oh, my gosh. I found. Did you see that hop? That's what I did in the store. I did that in the store. I found the little ceramic gnomes. Yes. So, I found the two pink ones. I'm so excited. I'm so excited about these, guys. And then I found two of the green ones. They did not have the blue ones in my store. And so I hopefully I can find the green ones. Guys, these would be great for all year decor. I mean, the green could be for Christmas. The pink could be for just spring, Easter, Valentine's Day. I mean, come on guys. The, you could use these all year round, but how adorable would this be? on the little shelf with some floral just sitting there. So, yes, that's the reason why I bought those. 
And then I have everything kind of sitting around because it's a pretty decent little haul. Okay, I did find the wooden ceramic, um, what are they calling them? Just decor uh, with this wood and this tile. Nice, guys. I picked up Love Blooms here. And I picked up a Blessed. These are nicely made, guys. These are so nice and heavy. They just looking at them on camera does not do them justice. And then I got trust your purpose. I love that saying, trust your pur purpose. I want to give this to my youngest daughter. I think that'll give her some inspiration. Okay, moving along to some more uh, seasonal decor. I was able to find the gnome garden flags in my last haul. I was able to find a couple of other like um, gar spring garden flowers, <laughs> spring garden flags. I'm gonna get this right. But this is what I was excited for, guys. It was the Nomi ones. And so we'll open this one up because I want to see how this one looks out of the package. It says, keep life simple, yes. So this one will definitely go in my front yard. And like I said before, they are kind of thin, but if these tear up, they're a dollar, you know? So I have spent five, six, seven dollars on um, garden flats before to decorate. So I was excited to find the gnomes. I have never been a gnome fan, but Dollar Tree has converted me since those uh, Christmas gnomes, they, they have. Okay, I found some more spring signs, and I don't know if I'm going to keep these this way. I might try my hand at some DIYs because I love the concept, but I'm not really in love with what's on them, if you know where I'm at. a welcome home in the little truck. I love the colors, but I'm not really a fan of the tulips and the butterflies. I don't know if it's just the way that it's set up. I don't know. And it may be just me. And then I found the other truck in Hello Spring. But I mean, I love, I, I love the way that the signs are, you know, like this, the way it kind of pops out. See if you can see it kind of pops out a little bit right here. I mean, I like that, but I'm not really a fan of the pattern. And this glitter does not come off. There's no glitter fallout on these signs right here. So, I mean, I picked them up. We'll see. We'll, we'll try my hand at maybe some DIYs. I did not find the Easter cutting board decor. <laughs> I'm so sad. Okay, and then I was able to find the blue truck in this welcome like this. Now, I love this little sign, and I love the concept of all three of them, and I don't know. I may do some kind of little picture scape with those, but yes, I was excited to find that one, and then this one I'm a little disappointed in, and I may do a little of my own oomph to it, but it is this sign right here that says, Welcome Spring with the mason jar and I'm excited that I found this but I thought the spring was galvanized for some odd reason I thought I seen someone haul these and I thought the spring was galvanized but it is it is a plastic um plastic piece right there that is plastic so okay I mean I do love the color concept of what's going on um and I love this picture I may see if I can vamp that up. Maybe they'll get some of those galvanized little signs, the little word signs, and I can just vamp that up. Okay, uh, moving along, I just picked up a um, little padded envelope. I'm going to uh, mail Miss Frugal J, hey girl, um, some extra gnomes uh, that I bought. So I needed to pick up a padded envelope for her. And we will move along into some beauty care. Well, it's not really beauty care. We'll, we'll just, we'll move on to the next area. I found these Suave Hand Cleaning Wipes. 
It's for refreshing on the go cleaning without drying out hands with vitamin E, pH skin balance. And I picked up three of these guys. I have never seen these in my store. And they're, there are 48 wipes in here. They are six by three by six by seven. So it's a pretty decent little wipe. You cannot flush them. It does say that on there, but an Unlever product, yes. So I picked up three of those. And then I picked up in that area, I found these Body Benefits by Body Image Exfoliating Buffer. I picked up a couple of these, guys. I've never seen these in the Dollar Tree. I have in my Dollar Tree, but I have seen these hauled by one other, um, YouTuber, but yes, and it says level of vigorous three, and it's an extra large size, so that's what that says, guys, if you can see, but yes, these are good for uh, gift sets if you're doing it for the man of your life, or if you want to use that exfoliator, you don't have to be a man to use that one, just because it's, um, are you okay? Ginger is coughing. Um, you don't necessarily have to be a man to use this either. So if you're a woman, uh, but I picked up one in blue and one in gray. <laughs> Same. Okay, next I picked up this Softy Enriched with Shea Daily Hairdress Mango Butter. Um, my daughter loves this stuff. So I went on ahead and picked up another one for her. Okay, and then I just some random little things. I picked up a black pot holder. Uh, Ginger got a hold of one that my husband left out and tore it all up. Okay, next, I am actually drinking on this, guys. It is, what is it? Victor Allen's Coffee. It's iced latte chilled coffee drink. This one is in mango. And then I picked up a vanilla. And then the one I'm drinking on right now is the caramel one. And they don't taste too bad. I mean, they're okay. I mean, it's not, it's not Starbucks. But it has a good taste to it. I mean, it, it's not bad. I mean, I don't think I would repurchase this. So, I mean, if you want to try it, to just try it, just try one. Don't buy multiple ones like I do. Some. Crayolas for the grandkids and just a Crayola uh, hard case for them. I always keep things like this available for them. I just cleaned out my laundry room and reorganized it. And I did throw away a bunch of Crayolas that were broken and they needed some more. Okay. And this is another little random product, but I always buy my um, dishwashing pods at the Dollar Tree. Great deal, 10 for a dollar. And then, guys, anytime they have this at the Dollar Tree, I pick it up, and it is a lime away. It is the toilet bowl cleaner. I always pick this up because our area is really high in rust in the water. And so, will get like these pink rings around the toilet and this is the only thing that gets them out. Okay, next, and this is, no, I have a few more. Oh my gosh, this is such a large haul. I cannot believe I found some of the amazing products, but y'all, Thai Bowl. Oh, or is it Thai Bowl? I've always called it Thai Bowl. <laughs> I found this at the Dollar Tree and I was ecstatic. I was like, yes, this is name brand. I am definitely going to pick up a couple for our toilet. So yes, 300 flushes, blue water with every flush, helps fight hard water stains and build up. And I definitely need that in my house. So yes, at the Dollar Tree, yes, yes. Okay, in my last haul, I picked up these Copper Fit face protectors. I did go ahead and pick up one in pink for my granddaughter. And then this was the blue I was talking about um, for the boys. So I picked up two of these for the boys. 
And I didn't really get into detail with it, but it's moisture wicking, UPF, 30 sun, protect, sun protection, and thermal regulation. So that's what the back looks like, guys. Lightweight, breathable, comfortable, secure fit. I thought the, the my grandkids could use them. So I went on ahead and picked them up. They were still there. And I know these cost a lot more at Walmart. Okay, these are my last few things. They restocked some of the bins, uh, organizational bins, and I was excited to find some more. So I picked up the gray ones like these. Just picked up a couple of these. And these are well made for a dollar. That's what those look like, little square bins. And then I picked up the like basket ones like this. I picked up a couple of these. And these are just by the Essential brand. Well, this one is a green briar. So I think this one's a little different. This one's Essential brand basket. So, yes, I'm excited to be able to organize with those. And then I was able to find two of the, like, file baskets. I love this material. Now, I will tell you this, and I almost didn't pick them up because the reasoning behind me buying these is that I use these for our hot tools, like our curling irons and flat irons, whenever they're not hot, um, blow dryers and things like that. But these, these are kind of more on the flimsy side. Do you see that? Did I just get a bad batch <laughs> at the Dollar Tree? Look at this. I mean, they're very flimsy. I almost didn't get them, but um, I redone my girl's bathroom and I kind of wanted everything to be a little bit more on the cohesive side. So I have picked up some, some of these to put and replace of those other bins in there and to replace the hot tools in there as well. So of course I did pick up two of the gray in this one with this cut. And then I picked up the pink one in this cut. The pink bins are gonna be for my bathroom and my purposes. They will have the gray in theirs. So Yes, guys, that is my Dollar Tree haul, and I was so excited to be able to find these items. I hope that you're able to find these items in your store. I will see you in my next one. Stay positive. There's always tomorrow. Bye, guys.